Uh, that case made us wonder when it comes to violent crime, how does Lincoln compare to years past? Channel 8's Alexa Skoneski joins us now with the details on that. Alexa. Yeah, that's right, Rod. Violent crime in Lincoln rose last year compared to others, and so far in 2021, things aren't looking much different. The city has seen seven homicides so far this year, two of those just in the last month. The number of homicides in the last 10 years has varied. Back in 2011, the city saw one homicide. Compare that with 2016, Lincoln had 11, the highest number of deaths in over a decade. In 2020, police saw violent crimes go up compared to previous years. Records show we saw about a 40% increase compared to 2019. According to law enforcement, Lincoln had seven homicides last year. And in 2021, numbers aren't looking too much different. Murders count for less than 1% of total crimes in Lincoln. LPD says there have been seven homicides so far this year, two of those just in the last few weeks. On October 18th, Lincoln police responded to an assault near 27th and Vine Streets that left a 29-year-old man dead. The caller reported that a man had been struck with a pole and the CPR was in progress. Officers of the center team received the call and arrived within three minutes, along with members of Lincoln Fire and Rescue, and began life-saving measures. Detectives later ruled his death as a homicide. Not even two weeks later, on the 30th, two men walked into a local hospital with multiple gunshot wounds to their neck and legs. A 24-year-old man was pronounced dead. A second victim remains in serious condition. Police say this was a deadly drive-by shooting on Highway 77 near Rosa Parksway and West A Street. We do not believe this was a random act of violence and have no indication the public is in danger currently. Police said this year our community is not experiencing an alarming increase in homicides compared to previous years. However, any time there's a homicide, it is concerning. They say it's a tragic loss of life and leaves family and friends without a loved one. The department says they grieve with each family and know that they must do their best to hold the people responsible accountable. LPD said in a statement their focus must be to conduct a thorough investigation to ensure we can accomplish that and see successful prosecution of those arrested. Now, according to LPD's 2020 annual report, all seven of those murder cases last year have been solved. Rod. All right. Thank you very much, Alex.